Hi, I'm Matthew. If you're new to the channel, welcome. If you're a subscriber, thank you. Today we're going to be doing a shave video. I'm going to wet my face real quick. Sometimes I get so excited, I want to do that later after I've shown you all my gear. Today's razor that I'm going to be using is the Blackland Vector. This is an all stainless steel razor polished by yours truly. Open cone. I get excited. Three piece razor. Uh, of course, you know, the top cap comes off. It's a little bit tricky because that stud is not completely round. It's more squared off. So in order for me to do this on camera, I'm gonna take that blade this blade here I'm going to try to drop it down on there since i got big hands it's tricky with these little pieces slide that together see if i can get that started oh nice before i get too far into it i almost forgot i'm going to be using the feather blade it's an artisan club blade and if you watched my last video i talked about some of my top five favorite artisan soaps and uh i got a little carried away with the scent but uh shannon soap company this one is silk pajamas now of course we're gonna have to smell this thing you know what this re reminds me of this smell Think back in your childhood on Christmas Eve. We always got to open one present. That present was always pajamas. You pull them out of the package and you get a big old whiff of them. This smells nothing like that. This is more of a sweet, warm tobacco smell. And I do, I do like the tobacco smells. I'm not going to lie to you. Have some of that already loaded up in my 3D printed bowl. I'm gonna be using the Simpson T2 brush. I'm just gonna soak that since this is a synthetic brush. You don't really have to soak it for very long. Go ahead and start getting the lather going. Now, you know, when I was talking on my last video, it's it very difficult to say which one of your artisan soaps can only fall into that one category um we we just all love them we love all of them this is a great performer as well need a little bit more water she's thirsty how are you guys doing today did you enjoy your weekend? We got our pool opened up. That was exciting. Still a little bit cold for that, but May is here. Just keep on the lather. Still not at that 500 subscriber. But we'll get there one day. All right. I think we are ready to go. I was thinking for my next video, what should I do? Should I do a video? about kind of an intro for beginners video or a blast from the past on my military shaves i've been wanting to do a straight razor shave just so many options got some new soaps coming in this week from sterling i may have to do a midweek video for that I'd like to say thank you to everybody that's made some comments. 
recommendations. <clears throat> Excuse me. Got a little soap there. Never hurts. Get this razor warmed up here. Very smooth. This is quite a bit wider than the standard uh, double edge razor, so it really gets a lot of coverage there quickly. No problem rinsing out with just a little shake in the water. Nice sharp blade. The old game changer is going to be fighting for number one here. Yes, I do enjoy this razor. I did get the solid bar as well. Nice, very nice. Finally, no more common story mess up. <laughs> get a little bit of water on my hands here. Mm, that is such a nice shave. Pretty close. Not a whole lot left for pickup. Soap is nice and slick. Awesome smell. So slick that I better double rinse my hands. I hate to have that razor slip out of my hands. Have you guys used San Shannon's soap? A little bit of a tongue twister. Too many S's. Shannon's soap silk pajamas. <clears throat> Gonna go across the grain. I just feel like the uh, shave video is going so quick because this thing is just covering so much more area. Just... It's like if you had a mower that was a 54 inch and you jump up to a 72 inch deck, you just get so much done quicker. Two passes. Very smooth, very smooth. Off camera here, I've got a bowl full of cold water. Do a little rinse here. I try to keep these videos pretty short, around the 10 minute mark or so, give or take, depending on how distracted I get. I'm not a real big fan of the 20, 30 minute videos. I'm gonna do a little ice cube 
ice cube starting to whittle down on me. Need to get another, another one. That ice is very nice. Slippery too. Use the old Lancaster towel. This thing absorbs the water so well, you almost have to pat dry if you pull it. Kind of squeaky. And I forgot to mention, I'm going to use the matching splash. Kind of shake it up. It's one of those ones that kind of settle out. It does have a little restrictor in there. Yeah, I was saying earlier, this is a tobacco scent, and it's more of a tobacco blossom. It's not uh, like a cured tobacco like Tom Ford's. All right. A little bit different smell. And we're going to do a little bit of star jelly. Well, that ought to do it, guys. Great shave. The old razor there from Blackland Razors performed excellent. I highly recommend it if you guys venture out to get one. Good luck. Uh, I don't think you'll be disappointed. Uh, sometimes those razors are a little bit hard to get, uh, you know, with all this COVID stuff going on and the demand. Sometimes they have the polished ones. Sometimes they don't. The machined ones work just as well as the polished ones. It's just a preference on what you like. I will uh, put a video or a picture right here of all the stuff that I used in today's shave. And uh, if you've made it this far and you're not a subscriber, please subscribe, like, share. You guys have a good one.